for my video project I'm going to show how to change the oil on this Fiat 126 and it's a little different from other newer cars because this one doesn't have a, an oil filter you can change it has a centrifugal filter which is right here which you have to clean out instead of changing it out so I'm gonna start by jacking up the car and putting it on jack stands okay now that I have the car in the air I'm gonna loosen this uh, drain bolt and drain the oil out into this container Now that I have the oil draining, I can focus on taking this whole rear end of the car, so I can get to the um, the oil filter. There's four, four bolts down here, and four bolts down here. The engine is uh, supported right here by this uh, back piece. So when I take this out, the engine uh, will fall if I don't support it from under. So I'm going to take the jack and I'm going to support the engine from underneath here so that I can take out this bolt and pull this piece out. So now that I have the rear end off the car, this here is the centrifugal oil filter. And um, I'll need to loosen these six bolts to get access to the inside so that I can clean it out. Now that the bolts are out, I'm gonna try and see if I can pry this open. Yeah, like that. <laughs> now what I have to do is scrape, scrape all that out of there. You can see I already took it out here. So that's the layer that is on there of dirt and also on this one I have to take it out. So that's the one on the engine cleaned out. You can see a big difference in size here. So now I just have to do this one. So this the filter housing now clean. No more dirt in there. This was all the dirt that was in there. Just this housing. There was even more in the engine one. I'm gonna use the old O-ring. Again, it looks fine. So now I just need to assemble it all again. So now I've put the rear end back on again and assembled the oil filter down here. I just have to tighten the bolts and the, the engine mount and then I can pour some oil in. So now I'm ready to pour the oil in. This is the oil I got. It's a little bit thicker than usual because this is an old car and it's also mineral oil but uh, it'll do. So I just got done pouring in the oil as you can see, it's at the correct level. And the rest of the oil I've put on over here in the luggage compartment for if I may need it, if it runs out or something. <coughs> now just all that's left is to start it and see if it still runs. All right, let's see. Runs great. The oil light is not on. That's a, a plus. Let's see if we got any leaks. Doesn't 
seem like it. So now I'm just gonna do some light uh, servicing to finish this uh, oil change off. Gonna oil up the doors and the uh, hinges and everything that might squeak a little. So I'm just gonna take some WD-40 right in there. And on the hinge here. Also on the other side. Put that some WD-40. And that finishes up my service of this Fiat Polski Fiat 126. So now we are ready to go home. <laughs>